Hey guys, Jolly Cover here. Welcome to another tutorial video. So today I'm going to show you how to download custom maps for Call of Duty 4. Um, after this video is released, I'll also start filming how to get um, mod menus for COD 4 on the PC as well. Um, but let's get into the custom maps. So first, you want to head over to this website. I'll put it in the description called cod4.gamebanana.com slash maps yeah it's a good website for custom maps so first you just want to scroll down and find one you like so let's get this one top top rock four so then you scroll down and you click the green download button here and um, I don't believe you have to be a member uh, to download stuff, so that's fine. <coughs> but then that will take you to another page. And it says your download will start shortly. So um, yeah, I'll come back when my download started. Okay, I'm back and uh, my download started, but basically you just have to watch the ad here. Where the download provided by gflclang.com. It's only like a 30 second ad. This was uh, the COD Ghost trailer ad. It's only 32 seconds long. So then you just wait for that to load up. At the bottom here. And I advise you to make a folder on your desktop actually. Um, wait a so see here, COD 4 custom maps. I have a folder here with all the maps that I play and use, so you can keep that open for now. So now my down is done. You're also going to want to have Wing Bar to open this up. You can minimize the internet for now. So now when you've got the map up, you're going to get three files. Uh, two um, that are the same, just one of them is a load file, one of them is the actual map, and then you've got the IWD. Um, so once you have that open, you're going to want to open up your computer. Not an actual computer, don't, don't, don't panic. Then you go to the C drive. Then program file 86. And it depends if you've got a cracked version or Steam version. If it's a cracked version or from another website, it should be at the top here and it will be an Activision folder. But mine's from Steam, so just click on that. Then you scroll down to Steam apps. You won't have to do all this if you, like I said, have a different version. But um, this folder will appear uh, if you don't have the Steam version. This is still what it would look like. So now you've got all these um, folders here. So you want to go to Zone, English, and then you see you've got all the maps here, the original maps and stuff like that. So now you're going to want to drag in the bottom file and the top map file, not the dot dot, the actual thing, then you, the maps that are in here now. I can go back and go to miles, of it. no sorry main, go to main and now you're going to see all of these IW files. Um, I think the default is 13. Uh, these for a custom map, and you have to, or if you have, if you realise these aren't the same as the middle file. So what you do is you drag in the middle file, and then you rename it to IW underscore the next number in the map list so if mine's 18 
yours will probably be 14 or just just look at the bottom number here so now that's all you have to do so now let me hop onto COD 4 and I'll be back so now that we're on COD 4 you're going to want to go onto your options go on game options and make sure enable console is on yes and for this part you're going to want to make sure you've remembered the map name because it's not on start a new server they're all the default maps so so what you're going to have to do is click the button above tab and next to want open the console and type in map mp and then make sure you remember the name and then it's underscore and then this one's called tobrock underscore four so then once you type that in the map will load up on a team deathmatch, that's the default thing. But um yes, yeah, it's got its own picture, so it's created by Ramza, HQ script by Haratus and Wara P. I can't see that at all. I don't know if it's meant to be blurry. But yeah, now you just wait for it to load up. Some some of the mini maps are like that, so don't worry. But yeah, once you're in the game, just wait for the wake up to be, to be ready for you. So the map begins. And there you go, so now you are in the custom map that we just downloaded. It's a very nice map. Um, actually, I played it a bit earlier. It's gonna record another mob menu anyway. But then I'll have to watch it just for a but yeah, the mini map is, um, is the jacket on this, but if you actually look on the side, the side view is not jacket, you can see it fine. But that's if you want to play like that, you just want to go full out, and, you know, kill, blah blah blah, run. It's actually a nice map, I do like it, for some of the actual default ones. Very um, fast paced gameplay. It's not a huge map. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed that tutorial, guys. I hope it helped. Make sure to leave feedback if you want me to do another tutorial video on God of War, which I will do. I'll show you how to do more things next. Um, and, and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye. One equal, the love is lethal, but I'm glad to see you One hand, two hand, three hands, my fans got me thinking I can't do whatever I plan